Hey guys, and welcome to Phantasmal City of Darkness. Now this is a Cthulhu, or Lovecraftian I should say, inspired roguelike survival horror game and... Come on, pick it up, there we go. It is in early access, so some of the things that you see here are not necessarily the final product, so some things like graphics, textures, I don't know, uh, story elements, animations and whatnot. Could change, so what is this? Looks like... Okay, so this is just kind of... Like upgrades and whatnot, and health items I suppose. So let's close the menu there. I've not played this yet, so I'm not sure what I'm getting myself into. Can I go through this door? No, I cannot. We do have a gun, and... I think... So it looks like we have $28, 7... There's something deeply wrong about this place. I have to find Jackie. Get out of here. Quickly. Alright, so there are a small amount of story elements in it, it seems like. So far, at least. Basically, I guess he's just kind of looking for Jackie. Not sure who Jackie is, but again, I'm sure the story hasn't been too developed quite yet. We're going to take a wood plank, I guess. Okay, so it's a weapon. Can we take... Okay, I thought maybe we could take these off and uh, take a trip into there. Let's turn on the light, though. Pretty... Pretty damn dark in here. So, are you up there in the right corner? We have 15 bullets, zero keys, seven flares, $28. And I'm not sure which one's the health. I think the little, like, arch shaped thing, half circle, whatever you want to call it, is our health. And then there is a sanity meter in this game. So, I think that's what the star might be. It's pretty creepy thus far. I mean, it's dark and... There's a weird beeping sound. I'm not sure what that is. Holy shit, it's dark down here. Jesus Christ! Alright, so who's breathing down the back of my neck? You guys hear that, right? This is not just me. Alright, well I'm gonna go over here. What the fuck is that? Oh, there's like a little music box here. Alright, that breathing behind me is creepy as shit, but I'll take a key. And, uh... Jesus. Pipe bomb, eh? That might come in handy. Is this light on? I mean, I don't want to say I feel safer with a light on, but... I mean... I guess I do. I'm not sure if that has, like, a bug or something, that breathing, like, right directly in my ears. Hey, dude. Are you gonna fucking attack me or what? Alright, you seem okay. I mean, you seem batshit insane. But. Again, I assume these coins are going to be used to buy upgrades and stuff. Should we be able to go back up there? To our bedroom? Hey, man! That's pretty rude. No, oh, I stepped in goop. So is this guy like... <gasps> oh, sanity pills. I'll take some of those. I guess I needed some because it let me take them. I don't know if I have to press a button to use them, but I think it just automatically uses them. We'll go to the left. The, uh, character model variance is not the best, but again, early access, so I'm sure they can add some more variety there, but, hey, maybe the whole premise of this is that they're all cousins or clones or something, I don't know. Maybe that could be a story element, okay. Got a bar with some creepy-ass music. 
Oh shit. Dude, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Fuck off. What a weirdo. Oh god, that guy. He frightened me, right? Fuck off. Just two two clobbers to the brain and they're dead, that's you know. Definitely preferable, I suppose, to having to hit him a thousand times. Alright. I'm not sure why everyone's listen listening to the uh same creepy ass music. The complete eviction of the residents of the Kowloon Walled City is almost complete. Only a small number of stragglers remain. Once they are cleared out by the authorities, demolition of the structure will begin. Okay, so this is that... Okay. Interesting. I'm not sure if you guys are familiar with the walled... Whoops. The walled the city. Eviction of the residents. But... Jesus. It's like the super tightly packed, or was a super tightly packed city that was in... A relatively small area, admittedly. I'm not sure how big or small the area was, but I think the population density was some crazy amount of times greater than that of like New York City or something like that. I haven't read about it in a while, but sorry, I apologize for not being able to divulge a little bit more into it, so to speak, but. Is this an elevator? Yeah, cool. Most of the people on this level should have been evicted already. Yet, I can still hear footsteps and other voices. Some of the worst addicts must still be down here. Alright, good. So we've got some addicts. What is this, a pipe? Can I, can I take it? I I want to take it. Oh, okay. It's a light. <clears throat> totally, totally knew that. Fuck. I don't know if I have a battery. I assume I do, because my light was flickering a little bit. But, I think it recharges, maybe? More boards. Okay, guess we'll go in here. Yeah, see, it's flickering right there. Crap. I just want this coin, man. That's loud. That's really loud. Anybody over here? Can you, uh, give me some directions and s this is the where to go? The game looks... okay, for what it is, I suppose. Any more boards anywhere? Can I? Yeah, cool. I don't want to use up all my ammunition, you know? What? Guess I can't use my boards. Alright, interesting. Jesus Christ. Why is there so many bottles everywhere? I wonder if I can just sneak by this guy here. Why is everyone's legs broken, first of all? Okay, I think being in the dark makes your insanity go up a little bit. Do you need an inhaler, or we good? Wow, I shot the door open. That's pretty cool. Only got eight bullets left. Oh, Jesus Christ! 
Alrighty. So, I could really use a board right about now. There we go. Oh! Whoa. Hey, buddy. What, what are you... Yeah, I, I agree. You got some sandals there, huh? I, uh... Alright, I have... Have a nice day, buddy. I'm just gonna go smash your friend's head in with a board if that's okay with you. Hopefully you don't get too angry about that. Oh, hello. Goodbye. Dude, you're really starting to fucking creep me out. Why are you following me? Jesus. I'm gonna kill you, okay? Cause you're you're freaking me out, man. What is that? I take it whatever that was didn't really appreciate me killing his his. What are you? Hello. What the? What? What? Go the fuck away! Ugh. Ah! What the? Wait! Die! Oh, Jesus! Oh! What the fuck was that? Oh, well, someone was getting their nipples. Electrocuted by a car battery, I think. Holy shit. Fucking Cthulhu monster killed me. Well, they didn't kill me, but. He gave me a wallop, that's for sure. I don't want to be here anymore. Yeah, so. I'm. Oh, God. Fucking. Die, it Mountain Dew. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, so you can stop making that crying now if you want. What is that red light? Who's speaking Chinese or Japanese? Whatever it was. Oh god, I can feel the monster. Nope, nope. Kill you, kill you dead. Run! Oh my god. Fuck, 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 fuck. I'm stuck. Oh my gosh. Well, I'm pretty sure I'm fucked because I can't get over the stupid. Maybe he won't see me if I sit up here. Oh god. He sounds like I don't know. I No. Go what How are you still alive? What are you doing? Wash your hair and then wash your body cuz you're I mean there's like a thousand million mosquitoes fly things around you. Oh my god. This is a bad situation to be in, man. I'm just gonna take my coins. All right. Well, you sound like a pedophile. Bro, I ain't afraid to punch you. I only got three bullets left, but I'll punch you right in the noggin. Why are you- you're- 
See, dinner is ready. Go, go to whatever that was and get dinner. Cause I'm sick of your shit. You're, I'm gonna have to get a restraining order, and I really don't want to do that because I have to deal with like the police and it's a whole process. But I'm just saying, fuck off. All right, there's a door here. I'm just gonna... Can I close this? I guess not. Can I push it closed? No. Alright, well I hear footsteps. If I could find some health or... Some ammo? That'd be jolly. What's this? Incense. I'm not sure what that's going to do for me, but uh... You know, I'll take it. Christ. Could I be any loud? Oh, there's an elevator. Cool. They were wolves. Almost beyond recognition. They seem more animal than human now. All of them have a violent reaction to light. And are hyper-aggressive. Fortunately, their poor sight means I can elude them. As long as I don't... Yeah, so just hide like a... Little wimp. Oh, I got an achievement. So far, so good. I wouldn't necessarily say good, but all right. So I'm getting some, getting some sanity back, I think. Which is always good. Will this give me some more? Slowly returning to red, so I think we're we're doing pretty decent. We've got fifty-six dollars. And we got a oh, an elevator that leads to an elevator. Interesting. Okay. Looks like we're in a sewer or something now. Looks like our sanity is fully back. I don't trust anything being behind me. What is this, a flare? Yeah, okay. I wonder how many levels there are. Some creepy ass music, man. We've got another key. And an Inga. What is this? An elevator? No, it's just a... Thing. This looks like an elevator, though. <gasps> Alright, we're going back up. Great, more sewers. I love sewers, they're my favorite place to be. I cannot see a goddamn thing. I suppose it's better than being physically abused by Cthulhu monsters, though. They have like half of a face. What is this, a burrito? No, it's a mattress. Maybe my light doesn't go out. Alright. Any, anything over here? Can I break that or no? I'm glad people are leaving all their money around. That's very generous of them. Dude. No. I'm just gonna... Did he see me or no? I definitely so... Oh my god, there's two of them. Jesus. Oh shit. Oh shit. Did he see me? I gotta get by them though. I'm 
I'm going insane. I'm going insane. Fuck it. YOLO! Oh god, there's three of them! Oh no, not a gangbang. Not a Cthulhu gangbang. No, 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 no. Fuck, fuck, fuck. There's three of them. Oh god. Alright, well.